The time I went to a hairdresser from hell and spent $1,200 on my hair. Then switched hairdresser. So, I have royally fucked up putting some of this in my hair. Anyways, what had happened was, um, I fell asleep with bleach in my hair. I fell asleep with bleach in my hair for two hours. This is not okay. The tips of my hair are clear. So, I was growing my hair out, but Miss Thing needs a trim now. So I think I'm just gonna base it off of when it starts to literally stretch and then cut it there. So, that is a good amount. Like this part right here, like wait for it. Okay, this is the finished product. We chopped it and it's like this lilac purple color. I think this was a blessing in disguise. Waking up in the morning, thinking about so many things. I just wish things would get better. I'm trying to get rid of them, but nothing seems to stay the same. Woke up in the morning, till my hair make. Why do I feel like that I'm gonna be doing your hair like moments? Oh my god, Alana, it's stuck. <laughs> Wait, oh my god, Hannah! I'm, gonna, I'm gonna panic. Oh my god. I'm panicking. Turn it off! Turn I it did, off! I did, I did, I did! Wait. Oh my god, Alana. Okay. You need to help me immediately. <gasps> Why is it getting stuck? Oh my god, oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Anna. I'm gonna panic. Oh my god, how, it, how is it gonna come off? Wait, it's because okay. you wrapped it. I always, Shit. I always wrap wait, it wait. here. Shh. You're getting it, I feel it, I think so. Please help me. You're getting it? I think so, I got it, I got it, I got it. Oh. That could have been so disastrous. Bad. Okay, Maybe, we should... <laughs> Maybe we shouldn't drink while we do this. Yeah. You know? It's probably a bad idea. Yeah. Yeah. Cheers. Okay. We pulled it together, though. You know, get ready with me on my channel soon. When you pay $1,200 for 18-inch extensions, you and you end up with hair one inch longer now, than before. This is exactly why you need to do your own research before choosing your stylist. This client got extensions done at a different salon about two months ago and came in because they were starting to bother her. As you can see, all these little white dots next to the extensions are unfortunately all pieces of her hair that have been ripped out from the root. This is us removing the extensions and she did lose quite a bit of hair. Thankfully, she had enough hair left over where it's not going to be noticeable damage. Unfortunately, the damage had already been made and we were just removing the extensions so no further damage would be made. A lot of the extensions were actually fused together and they were just improperly done. She had horrible amounts of tension where there was hair being pulled in several different directions in order to fit into the extensions. This extreme tension is what caused all this damage done to her root area. Extensions can be really fun when properly done. Please do your research. Here are the extensions that we pulled out and her hair that fell out with them.
important and I want to show you guys this. My client saw my video about overtone the other day and actually reached out to tell me she had it in her hair. So I adjusted my formula. Look at the pink. Do you guys see the pink? This is with 30 volume. 30 volume markets themselves as a conditioner that deposits color but it's actually closer to what carpet dye is so i'm going to have to formulate a toner to help neutralize that pink tone i swear to god all i was doing was blow drying my hair and i lost the back of it and it's now stuck my hair is stuck in the hair dryer oh my god it's actually stuck Ow! I can't get it out! Oh my god, I'm gonna rip my hair out! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Guys? Oh my god. We're gonna listen to Lissa, right? Look at this. Right? We're gonna listen to Lissa. Decided to chopstick curl my hair. At this moment I had a mini heart attack and gave up. What he asked for. What he got. <laughs> 